and it can happen anytime, anywhere. And that even includes at the state level. In West Virginia, state and federal officials announced how they've recovered stolen state funds from a check fraud scheme. News Channel 3's Marley Pinchock has the latest now from the Capitol. State and federal officials announcing the recovery of nearly a million dollars stolen from the state of West Virginia. The state auditor telling us this success was driven by a combination of determination and teamwork. If you don't do these things quickly, it becomes much harder. So the most important thing was that we have systems in place that identified the fraud quickly, was able to begin the investigation quickly, and, and we were then able to involve our bank community very, very quickly. According to West Virginia State Auditor J.B. McCuskey, the money was stolen through a check fraud scheme that remains under investigation. In this particular instance, we have two checks that totaled roughly a million dollars that were mailed to a vendor in Texas. Uh, we were able to quickly identify that these checks were not deposited into the vendor's account, uh, and we were then very quickly able to begin an investigation uh, to start to find who had, who had done this. United States Attorney Will Thompson says check washing happened. This is essentially where the payee of the check uh, was essentially washed off with a chemical agent and a new payee was placed. It's a fraud that is increasingly and is pretty pr prevalent. Uh, we're seeing a lot of checks are being stolen from the U.S. mail uh, and then are being check washed. According to the state auditor's office, the amount recovered so far represents roughly 85% of what was owed to the vendor. Efforts to recover the remaining amount continue. In Charleston, Marley Pinchock, WSAZ News Channel 3. Now, so far, no arrests have been made and the investigation is ongoing.